Ja, doen we. Yeah, it's great. You know, I love the atmosphere, real team oriented. So uh, things like that, you know, make it easier work environment. Anybody in particular like welcomed you and, and you know like helped you make you feel home? Help make you feel home? Yeah, I say uh, probably you know Kels, uh, Jared, you know guys like that that been around, you know, to this level. Well, you know, now that you've had a chance to practice here for a few weeks, how do you feel mm -hmm. your, skill, your skills uh, fit into the offense here? Yeah, I think they're going to translate well. You know, uh, a lot of similarities to what I've done in the past, you know, down in Tampa. And, uh, yeah, just correlating it and, you know, getting the rest of the playbook down so you can go out there for season. Uh, the line I mentioned last week that, that you guys talked pretty quickly, uh, that you guys have actually had a relationship before you joined the team. Just mm -hmm. what's it been like to work with him and how do you think you guys can work together as sort of a duo this season? Uh, who's that about again? Clyde. Oh, okay, yeah. So, yeah, uh, just, you know, watching from him and seeing how he goes about it, you know, I do the same thing. And uh, still, like, learning the nuances, you know, the little details that make, you know, all the difference in the play. So I guess that's probably be the biggest part. You had mentioned when you were signed that it would be a good one-two punch with you mm -hmm. and Clyde. But the Chiefs now are bringing back Jarek McKinnon. How do you think he'll – you're all, the three of y'all will be able to mess together. Yeah, well, it's a long season, you know, uh, preseason included, you know, can go like 24 games. So it's going to take more than just one guy. Uh, and, you know, I think that's what they're looking forward to. So, yeah, one, two, three punch, if you will, is all good. What made you pick Kansas City? I mean, I'm sure you had, you had other options, and why was Kansas yeah. City the place you wanted to go? Uh, I just thought they were the most Super Bowl-ready team now, you know, to get back there, you know, get my second ring. So, uh, that played a big factor, too. Uh, obviously, the quarterback, the system, coaches, you know, just fits a running backs uh, type of scheme. How much do you think working down in Texas has helped you to kind of get that rapport with Patrick? Yeah, I think that definitely helped, you know, for him to be able to see my speed on routes, my timing coming out of breaks and things like that. It just helps uh, translate when you actually hit the field, you know, live bullets. It's super early now, but you notice anything similar between like, Tom Brady and, and sort of the way Pat have been other obviously Yeah. Just like that command, you know, that presence of the offense, like Coach always says, you know, he got the keys. Uh, and, you know, just, yeah, I guess student of the game is probably the biggest comparison. You know, them two. You've, uh, you've shown in, you know, limited moments how good you can be as a receiver from that mm -hmm. outside field. Is yeah. there a chance that you think you'll have increased opportunities as a receiver? Uh, yeah, I think so. You know, coaches got me, you know, wide, uh, lining out wide, things like that, you know. Just things that they do in the offense. So in order to get on the field, I'm gonna have to, you know, do some of that work. So that'd be cool too. I'm always down for that. You're talking about pass pro line, also. Obviously, you can't do anything about it right now. But is that mm -hmm. something that you want to work on or have worked on in the past? What, what that part of your game looks like? Yeah, definitely uh, working on going forward. You know, got to learn new uh, pass protection concepts, and uh, yeah, got to keep the quarterback up. You know, that's number one. So. Yeah. How much? How much of that is mentally the, the concept? How much of it is physically being able to do it? Like, how do you split that part up for yourself? Uh, definitely, probably. Uh, Probably like 80% mental and physical. Just got to see where the bliss is coming from. And they do a good job, you know, giving us keys and stuff like that. So it's all new, but I've been in the league for a while now, so it's, yeah, it's getting easier. Do you guys have plans to get together before training camp? I mean, just coming to a team, yeah. getting this, you know, a little bit and then having some time off. Is there a plan for the running back group or the offense to kind of get together a few times? Yeah, I think we're going to be getting together uh, back in Texas again, so in that Dallas area. Yeah. Thanks, everyone. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.